All right, I'm going to call out some discrimination that I see in an article on MSN today. Um, this uh, CEO had raised the company's minimum wage, I would assume annual salary, to $70,000. And he said the number of babies born to staff each year grew tenfold and revenue soared. I think they mentioned home ownership as well. Uh, Gravity Payment CEO Dan Price introduced a minimum wage of $70,000. This was in 2015. Um, and uh, a lot of his staff bought homes. I, I know I saw homes in there, and a lot of them had babies, which is nice. I mean, the, the, the CEO, he, he's certainly free to do whatever he wants with what he pays. The problem I have is the focus on the babies. Uh, what about people who d didn't have any desire to have children? Maybe they want to write the number one back in an AI in the world, and now they did it because... Now they don't have to work a second job in order to make ends meet. There are certainly people who finally went on that trip to climb Mount Everest. Uh, there are going to be people who are eating healthier. Uh, don't get me wrong. If, if somebody wants to have babies and they finally get to do it, that's a very beautiful thing. Uh, but we live in a very baby-centric, relationship-centric world. And I think the CEO ought to know better. And I think he can set the lead by expanding his story to beyond just those babies. Don't get me wrong, very nice that he's having those babies, uh, but there's more to life.